The 2023 BMWs are starting to roll into the lot. Behind me, I have a 2023 430i xDrive, and I'm gonna give you guys the first look of it and show you guys what's different from last year. Now, overall, there's not too much different from the 2022 model. This is an M Sport package on the 430i. Also has the high gloss black exterior content. So this would be the high gloss black kidney grills, a little bit of silver still at the top, but black everywhere else instead of the chrome surround has the adaptive LED headlights. We got style 791 black wheels with the blue M Sport brakes. Looks like we got the Bridgestone Torenza tires on there. Brooklyn gray exterior. What a phenomenal color for this is. Was new for the M cars and now it seems to be taking over on all M Sport cars. M Sport rear diffuser at the back. I love how the 4 Series has the larger round dial that has the camera right on the inside. Also, when you pop the trunk, the gas-powered shocks pop it right up. Even though it's not fully powered, you still have to manually close it. It still just pops up for you. Now, there really is only one difference between the 2022 to the 2023 4 Series. I'm going to show you guys what that is. On the inside, Big doors. One thing I love is that seatbelt butler that fully surrounds the seatbelt. Now on the inside, this is black Sansa Tech on the inside, the M Sport steering wheel, the aluminum Texagon trim. Now let's talk about what is that change from 22 to 23. Take a look at the gauge clusters. Let me know if you can see what it is. Let's start it up. Full digital gauge cluster right here. So this would normally be 6U3, the live copper professional included this full digital gauge cluster. Now we have the full digital gauge cluster, but the infotainment screen is not pushing out to the edges like it was last year. So this is now the new standard option. Every car is gonna have the full digital gauge cluster with a small infotainment screen. There still is an option for 6U3 Live Cockpit Professional, and I believe, not 100% sure because BNI hasn't clarified, but that only is going to include the larger infotainment screen. That's kind of on par with what BMW is doing. They're not wanting to increase the MSRP pricing so far up. So maybe instead of just increasing the MSRP pricing on the Live Cockpit Professional, they just kind of split it in half. And now when you get that same $1,200 option, it's only giving you the larger infotainment screen on the inside. Overall, that's the interior on the 2023 430i. So as you can see, really not that much different from the 2022 model. It's just a small change that I wanted to highlight. It's the first one that we had coming in stock. They're just starting to arrive now. Still got a 2022 M442 deliver. And we have a 2023 X7 down there. So after that gets PDI'd, I'm going to make a video on it. A little bit of a short video, but in case anybody was looking at what is the 2023 430 and what were those changes from last year, now you guys know. I basically highlighted all of them, the one small change that I could find. There's some other tweaks in the ordering guide, like M Sport Pro package and whatnot, but just as standard features, that's what I had to showcase. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little video. Smash the like button, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys with more BMW news on the next video.